What up, though, Heist Man? The foe talk that talk, ghetto news and opinions, man. Come on, black people. Come on, y'all. Or it might even be white people, man. I think it's black people, though. But, man, y'all got to learn how to pick y'all battles, man. Come on, man. We talking about this right here, man. The University of Wisconsin. They is um removing the rock. Not this rock, man. Not the... If you smell what the rock is cooking. I'm talking about, like, a literal... Literally rock. A literal. I said literal. A literally a rock. This right here, they call them the racist rock. Um... On the University of Wisconsin, or Madison, University of Madison, Wisconsin, something like that, man. It's Wisconsin, so they ain't, they ain't, they ain't messing with us no way, man. But they had to move this big old rock, man. They got people to move this rock, man. Like, come on, man. They even had news articles about this, man. They've been fighting this little battle for a long time, man, about this rock right here in question, man. They call it racist rock. The, um, They removed it from the college campus after a black student union activist complained. How long they been fighting this, man? Since the 1920s. That's what the, um, they call it the racist rock, the N-word rock. I'm, I'm looking at the stuff on the, um, on the website now, man. It's like, it's crazy, man. It's a lot of stuff, man. It's the slang term they call the N-word rock, black rock. Um, university researchers did not uncover other instances in print where the rock was, um, referred to it as the N-word rock. But they said the Ku Klux Klan was active on campus at the time of the rock's dedication. So... It's hearsay, she say, but a lot of people saying it, man. That this rock right here is called the racist rock, man. And um, I rock y'all. I don't know, man. I mean, maybe I, I okay. I kind of feel you though, man. Like y'all would want to be going by this rock every day that they call racist rock and knowing they did stuff and said stuff about it. But come on, man. A rock, yo. That's what you worried about, yo. A rock, really. Come on, man. Pick your battles, man. Get, get better food in the cafeteria or something, man, um, student activists. Like, I ain't trying to deter y'all from this, man, because, you know, you got to stand up for your rights and what you believe in and stuff. But, man, a rock, yo, that's like literally a piece of um earth. Like, did they move the rock there and call it racist rock, put a plaque on it and black stone or something? I don't know, man. This is a crazy story, but I had to just put y'all up on it, man, because I seen this. I'm like, oh, that's crazy, man. Big shout out to the homie Ronnie Lee for giving me this story, man. That's some crazy stuff, though. But we definitely going to be talking about this Friday right here on this channel, man. I go live every Friday at 9 p.m. Come through and holler at me, man. Hit that like button, the comment button, the share button, the subscribe button, the notification bell. Nah, 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 All them buttons you got to hit to get this pimping that I'm putting out when I put it out. So we can get into conversations just like this. So y'all can be notified when I be saying some stuff. Because I say some stuff, man. Y'all just got to come through and holler at me, man. Like I said, I go live every Friday at 9 p.m. Come through. And I'll let your boy, Heist Man the Foe, talk that talk, ghetto news and opinions.